and I'll tell you and that is precisely why so let's say you did that previous technique and the scar really doesn't seem tight compared to the rest of your abs yes you can still get lower back pain from the scar because your brain might not be connected to your deep core muscles just yet after surgery think about it when you when you've just had surgery you're literally trying to shut off all muscles to, to contract if it causes pain right so you're avoiding to use any part of your abdominals and if you've had a cesarean you know how much pain that can be so after the pain is gone unfortunately your body is still wired to not use those muscles so you have to consciously connect your brain to those muscles again so to answer this question yeah i guess you can still have a moving scar but if your motor patterns aren't recreated you're going to still develop lower back pain and that is precisely why a c-section can cause issues with walking for sure imagine you're walking without using your abs and lifting and going about your day carrying your baby doing all the things just regularly around the house if you're not using your deep core muscles properly they're not connected you will absolutely develop lower back pain some kind of musculoskeletal pain because your movements just aren't controlled you can't move your arms and legs without your abs you just can't so my point is this you need to retrain your abs half of your rehab is doing the scar massage but the other half has to be doing the correct exercises to connect your brain to your muscles again so this is very much up to you and i'll tell you why if you can commit five minutes every day to doing one scar massage in one movement you're pretty much going to see results like very quickly so for example the moms i work with with their cesarean birth rehabilitation they're always so surprised at how quickly they need to change their five minute routine like the next week they're doing a new massage the very next session they're doing new exercises the pain has decreased the mobility has increased right the scar the appearance has improved this happens very quickly it's quicker than you can imagine especially when you start it with all the stability and pain you can't imagine that three months from now six months from now you're back in the gym working out so five minutes every day you will see results My cesarean recovery program has three levels of support and you can enroll at any time. It's always open for enrollment. So what you just saw there was the DIY program, the do-it-yourself program. The other two levels is this. One includes weekly live classes and also involves a full rehabilitation of your diastasis as well. So you're recovering to return to sport and exercise and activities. The other one is a full one-on-one -on -one support for three months. So basically you would get weekly sessions with me, direct messaging, it's almost like texting. It's like having a therapist in your pocket, right? So the different levels of support are for different people. Like if you think you can watch videos and rehab yourself and you're really good at that, do it that way. The reality is it is very important to work one-on-one -on -one with a therapist to know truly what your body needs. If you have any questions, send a comment below. about to head off to the lake for some open water swimming, but I'm not the only one who's awake at this time. Listen to the birds. <laughs>